the opening act of another major European club season. An epic tale lies ahead, a footballing drama to unwind over the course of the next ten months. One where the central cast, both team and individual, will get to write their own story should they survive long enough. This episode one. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. So it's back, bigger and better than ever before. We hope everybody is ready for another ride on the emotional roller coaster. Bring it on, Peter. I'm looking forward to a competition that always delivers entertainment, whether through its football or indeed its supporting cast of, of emotions. Neither of these teams will want a, a trip back to the drawing board after this, so I think we can expect something quite lively. So we're up and running. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? It's Benzema! Oh, that is very close. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. Valverde plays it forward. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Sterling proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had good options around him and he failed to get his head up. Hoists it forward, Ruben Diaz goes back to base. Keeper's got good distance on that. Vinicius Junior, he's found his man. Defence has got rid of that. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Valverde goes looking. Well played, he saw that coming. It's Bernardo Silva, plays it through. Uh, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And back to base. And it's played forward. Foden. Stones. Benzema has a pop! Oh, that's a fine save! Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. And the shot! Shot a goal! Just too much. Fractions. Valverde 
probably tried a bit too hard then. He should have relied on technique as opposed to power. Bernardo Silva. Foden. Rodri. Zinchenko. Benzema. Stones battles to win it back. And it's Sterling. Bernardo Silva. João Cancelo. Bernardo Silva. There were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to save from up here, I know. Stokes. And some clever work on the flank. Yeah, they seem to be encouraging both fullbacks to ease inside, so we'll keep an eye on that to see if it if it all works out. Oh, real tape shapes to shoot! A skipper's goal! Well, it's so hard to keep someone with his enthusiasm and his energy quiet. Second best will never be accepted in the world he lives in, and the timing of his goal won't be lost on him. It's crucial. That was a given. It always was. It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't heed, and they paid the price. And, this... and that'll be the last act of the first half. And here we are, off they go for half-time. The great move did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to go in with the lead at half-time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Real Madrid go in at half-time with a slender one-goal lead. Already up and running for the second half. Real Madrid carrying a one-goal lead. Bernardo Silva. Balls loose, who's getting there? Foden. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Valverde, Vinicius Junior, Sinchenko does well to read it and intercepts. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Tried to play it through. Oh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the pass and its obviousness was, was appreciated. Jao Cancelo. It's gone for a throw-in. Well, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Stones. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, this lead is beginning to look a little delicate. I'd rather see them show the ambition and adventure to go further ahead but it seems as if they've settled for a, a riskier approach now to defend us. Nacho. Tony Kroos. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Kroos needed to come up with a better ball. Hits one! Oh, that was no routine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Gabriel Jesus. Manchester City are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Gabriel Jesus. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. And the whistle has gone for a reckless challenge there. Mm -hmm. 
Ruben Diaz he is there to heave it away. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Ake. Real Madrid need to hold on for a few more moments. It'll be a throw in. Gabriel Jesus with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. Ruben Diaz can hoist it clear. Nacho. Sterling. And that is that. Real Madrid 